The VOTV Versatile Overt Tactical Vest has been selected by your organization as appropriate for the level of risk for the country you're traveling to. Included with the vest are instructions of care for the vest and its seven component parts. The first thing you need to do is make yourself familiar with the component parts. Open the sides by pulling back the Velcro and then you can open the vest. One of the reasons Velcro is used extensively on the vest is the difficulty of repairing zips in a hostile environment. From here, you can see it has a label inside. Put your name, date of issue, department, ID number, and blood group here. All of these covers have Velcro closings. And you simply open these up to get your sap. That's your soft armor panel. The panel must be removed to launder the carrier. The panels are heat sealed. Now it's important that this covering is never removed and it is checked to ensure it has no rips or tears in it. If it does, please return to stores or to us directly. If this is not possible, it will still offer some protection, but it is important that you replace it to offer optimum performance. Now, each soft armor panel has a label on it. It's very important when you reinsert the sap that you insert it with the label facing towards the body. So always look for these labels, ensuring that when you have the vest on, it would be towards the body. If the label becomes damaged, please mark this side with a marker. Repeat for all seven component parts. Front, back, groin, neck, and shoulders. Notice the shoulder pocket does not have Velcro fastenings as the closings overlap. To put it back in, you simply fold over the edges, open up the pocket, and place it in, closing the Velcro. This is repeated for all the panels in the cover, front, back, groin, neck, and shoulders. The vest can be worn with or without the groin protection as it's removable. Most of the time, the groin protection is worn up inside the vest. It's only deployed in high-risk environments. To engage it, simply place it over and fit the two tabs like so. You deploy it by putting your thumbs through here and pulling it down in one strong pull. You can remove the collar for comfort. The collar is held in by a Velcro strap. Simply pull to remove. To reattach, Follow the line of the Velcro around the neck. Haps, hard armor plates, are used to protect you from rifle fire, sniper fire, and AK-47 rounds. It is still very important to wear the plate with the label towards the body. On the label, you can see VestGuard UK details, level of protection, size, care instructions, and the model serial number. This particular plate is level four, which will stop armor piercing round 3006 caliber it's going to give you a very high level of protection. These plates are encapsulated in GRP and in the testing process it is dropped from about 0.5 meters so under very strenuous conditions these plates are still going to perform. To insert these you open the velcro pocket on the front of the vest and simply slide in and close the velcro. Personally I'd keep the plates inside the armor at all times. Then turn over the armor to find the back pocket. Open the flap and slide in the back plate. Your agency may have provided you with optional covers. To use the covert tactical cover, transfer your front and back soft armor panels as before. The hard armor plates are to be inserted in the pockets on the front and back. With the covert cover, you can only insert your soft armor panels. This can then be worn under your clothing. Please be aware this will only provide handgun and blast protection. If you need any further assistance, please contact us at Vestguard UK.